March 2017. For the second time in two years, smoke can be seen coming from Nebraska's Tecumseh State Correctional Institution. Two inmates killed during a disturbance inside the overcrowded prison. Oh, I'm so worried for my brother. There's murderers in there. Dakota's brother is an inmate. We're not revealing her last name to protect his identity. He's serving time for theft and burglary, nonviolent offenses like the forgery conviction that put Terry Barry in jail. Four weeks ago, Barry's cellmate strangled him with a towel. The suspected killer, Patrick Schroeder, was serving a life sentence for murder. Dakota worries her brother may face a similar threat. They placed him in Tecumseh, Tecumseh State Penitentiary, maximum, maximum security. My brother did not commit a violent crime. Dakota says corrections moved her brother without warning last month from the Nebraska State Penitentiary in Lincoln to restrictive housing at Tecumseh. The Department of Corrections won't comment on prisoner movement or specific living conditions, but Director Scott Frakes has said double bunking is safe in restrictive units. Inmates, as you can imagine, disagree. In a letter to us, one inmate in segregation says he shares a cell built for one person. This creates a dangerous environment, he writes, creates a lot of stress. Another says they are forcing us here in segregation to double bunk due to overcrowding. A prisoner abruptly moved to Tecumseh said the move makes him angry, like we're just discarded away from everything and everyone. I'm very scared for him. I believe that we all are. We're all scared for all of them. Fearing retribution, this mother of an inmate, also in restrictive housing, asked us to hide her identity. Inmates being unhappy with everything that goes on, the food, the way that they are treated, um, their living conditions, not getting programmed. I think that all of that has a play in it. The mothers of prisoners say their sons describe unsanitary living conditions. It's prison, but they feel it should be livable. Inmates dying for one reason or another, whether it's legitimate or not. They're, why are they dying? Why? Why are these inmates killing other inmates? Why are they stabbing them? Why are they, you know, why? I want to know why.